Hi, my name is Clash, and as the phrase goes, uh, today I'm playing Fable 2 because why the fuck not? And this is kind of two years in the make. Oh, come on, man. Don't do this to me. Alright, yeah, I'm trying to stay at this, the, the opening menu thing here. It, it, there's a, there's a fucking, there's a process, man. I can't have it going to the, the preview of, previews of the game that it shows before this. Or if you, if you don't touch the game for a while. So I'm going to keep on rotating the analog stick so it just stays on the screen for a minute. But this is kind of two years in the making. Um, I'm not sure that so many people that watched me two years ago when I started my channel are watching me now. In fact, probably very little of you uh, watched me back when I did Fable 1. And I would advise you to not go back and watch that series unless you're really bored. Because my commentary was really bad back then. I had just started YouTube, and it, I think it was like the third or the fourth series that I started on my channel. And um, for whatever reason, I never did Fable 2. And at the time, I didn't do it because I didn't have the game. But I could have gotten the game a long time ago. I just never decided to do it. I never went through with it. But now I finally bought the game again. Uh, the reason why I didn't have it before is because I sold it. After I got bored of it sometime after uh, buying it when it first came out. I played it for like two months straight or something. And uh, because I played it so much, I just got tired of it and then I sold it. But now I'm really looking forward to this. I had asked you guys in several other series, I'm pretty sure. Primarily the Pokemon Yellow series that I'm currently doing. If you guys would like to see me play Fable 2 or the, uh, the Fable series in general on my channel. And since I've already done Fable 1, I figured I would play Fable 2 and then replay Fable 1. Uh, after I'm done with Fable 2, just so I can see how much my commentary has improved, I suppose. Not to say that my commentary is fucking amazing, I'm just saying that in the past two years I've definitely improved. And, uh, if you were to watch my first Fable series, the difference would probably be quite dramatic from between then and now. So, with all that being said, let's go ahead and press A to start here. And so our story begins. Yeah, shut up. I don't like this woman. The woman that just talked, she's really an asshole. I don't think she means well, but whatever. Subtitles on. Uh, hopefully, I can change the, like, audio levels and shit at some point in the near future. But language, we're going with, yeah, English. United Kingdom, hell yeah, I represent. I'm not from the United Kingdom, I'm just saying. This is a, uh, English game, I suppose. It's very British. If that makes sense. And downloadable content. Uh, this feature is temporarily unavailable. I did get, like, the Platinum Hits edition of Fable 2. So, I do have the DLC for this game. And it should be pretty fun. Apparently, I can continue. Uh, maybe this Xbox still has the saves from way back when. But, uh, let's go ahead and start a new game. Who is the hero of our tale? Well, I'm definitely a boy. So, let's go ahead and then roll that. Then destiny unfold. That's great, lady. You'll figure out who she is soon enough. I don't like her. Um, you really don't know whose side she's on. She's kind of creepy and not right. Like, she, she's scary. She's a little bit unsettling. Whenever she talks, just sends chills down my spine. She, I, she has, especially at the end of the game. But anyways, I'll just go ahead and let this play out here. And you guys can enjoy the uh, intro thing. I don't, I don't remember if she talks at all during this. In fact, I think we're just gonna watch this bird fly around and do bird things for a bit. Yep. Listen to that music. It's great. I love the soundtrack for these games. And really looking forward to playing through this, as I already have mentioned. I miss this game. I haven't played it since it came out, really, and that was like maybe three or four years ago, so... Really, really excited. Oh, shit. Looks like stuff's burnt down over there, chopped down. And welcome to Albion, everybody. I think that's Bowerstone. And yeah, I guess Teresa isn't going to talk at all during this cutscene. Maybe it's during Fable 3's opening cutscene where she talks. I think so. I don't know if I'll be doing Fable 3, by the way. Uh, Fable 3 was definitely less than stellar when compared to the first two games, so... We'll see. Alright, bird. Doing your thing? Oh, he took a shit. That's great. Where's that shit gonna land? It's the most dramatic piece of shit I've ever seen! Oh wow, we didn't even get to see what it landed on! Oh wait a minute, yes we do. It lands right on me! <laughs> what was that? Oh, yuck. Nasty! Well, I 
here that's lucky. Like finding a four-leaf clover. <laughs> Although I think I prefer the clover. Yeah, me too. Oh, look, little sparrow. Castle Fairfax looks so nice in the snow. No, it doesn't. Imagine a grand dining hall. I bet Lord Lucian's having roast duck this time of year. That castle looks scary and shit. He's really lonely since his wife and his little girl died. In that big castle, all by himself. If only we could live there. You don't want to live there. Pretty sure Lucian is going insane. We'll find out more about that soon enough. I know, sounds like a party. And they didn't fucking invite us. What a bunch of assholes. Alright, follow the glowing trail to your next objective. Don't mind if I do. Let me uh, look at the options here. Really quickly. I want to see if I can boost the dialogue. Audio? Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Alright, sounds, voice, yes. Let's boost the voice fucking Make way up there. Make oh, a wish. Oh god, that is loud. Alright. Music and sounds, we want that a little bit lower. I think that's really right on target there. That's where we want it. Alright, sweet. Speakers, 5.1 surround. No, I just kind of have headphones on. I don't really... Oh, hi-fi, yes. I have hi-fi headphones. I don't even know if I have hi-fi headphones. I'm going hi-fi, it sounds cool. Uh, controls, video, hold on. Let's look at the video. Can we make this look any better? Oh, uh, we can just adjust the brightness. Looks good so far. We'll see if I need to change things going on. Glowing trail brightness. Subtitles on. Tutorials on. blah -de blah Yeah, alright. Looking good. I don't know if there's a difficulty setting. In fact, I'm pretty sure there isn't. If there was, I'd make it as difficult as I could because I really want the game to uh, challenge me. But I, I think it's just like a universal difficulty. Alright. Sweet deal. Let's go ahead and kick the Hello, fuck out of this chicken. Bones. You look hungry. Have you reconsidered my offer? Hey, hold on. Oh, scene paused. The dialogue is kind of extra loud, which is what I prefer, but I might have to just dip it down a little bit. Great. We'll never be that hungry. The answer is no. Hey, you sick fuck. You'll be back, and I'll be waiting for you. No, she won't. Get away from my sister. Get your nasty hat out of here. Come what on, is that, Spanner. blood? Let's see what's going on. Is that blood on your shirt? Get out of here. Yeah, I'll fucking... I'll kill you, man. Say, wait for my sister. Alright, hold on. Yeah. Yeah, I hate him too. I want to kick this chicken, damn it. Hold on, hold on. Oh, whoa, look at this wheel of Narnia. Uh, okay. I don't want to mess with any of this. I just want to kick the chicken. How do I do this? I forgot. Is there a way? Come on. Oh, damn. Look at my little toy gun. What is it shooting? Huh, interesting. Um, okay, put that away, please. I want to kick the- Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Hold on, I want to kick that other chicken. Somebody told me when I started to play this game to kick the chicken, like, out in this direction, I believe. All right, hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah, bye, chicken. He's dead. Oh, my God, it made a noise. Well, I guess that chicken's dead. We'll hold a ceremony for him later. Onward. We must follow the trail to wherever. Can I... Yeah, I want to check this out here. I think the dialogue is actually a little bit too high. I, I want it to be Make higher than wish. everything else, but not too much Make higher. Alright, that's good. I think that's pretty well balanced there. Alright, sweet. Games just have a habit of drowning out dialogue, and I want you guys to be able to hear what the characters are saying and all. Even though there are subtitles, but... You know. Have you seen that thing over there? Oh... It's just a trader. Not just any trader. He's a special trader. He's got a big hat. Alright. That's not how you say it, man. Gentleman? I have traveled the land, accumulating wondrous and mysterious objects, which I now offer to you for the modest price of five gold. That's a little too rich for my blood. Consider this. I'm a homeless kid. This is truly a magical mirror. For as long as you look into it, it will make you beautiful. What if I give you a fistful of I'll dirt? Take it. We take Very it for a fistful wise. of dirt. Now, just remember, the magic only works if you look at it in complete darkness. <laughs> oh. ah, now this is truly a marvel. This suspenseful music box is actually a device created by the ancients as used by the old kingdom rulers themselves look at this guy's mustache man turn the handle three times and you shall be granted a single wish sounds like a hoax to me there's no such thing as magic wow way to kill the mood 
We live in grim times indeed. The young are too world weary to believe in magic. Where the hell did you come from? Most children your age believe eagerly. Look, I can see your eyes are bad, but I'm telling you, that music box is rubbish. Wow, you're mean. That's what the seller thinks. He has no idea what he stumbled upon. But you have an inkling, don't you? Some part of you wants to believe it's magic. Yes! What? You... You really think it could be? Damn straight. Santa Claus is real. For five gold coins, you could have your answer. I'm telling you, we have to offer him dirt. Listen to me, Rose. At the end of that week, you and your little sparrow would be no closer to your dream. No closer to the inside of that beautiful castle. We don't want to go to that castle. Real. I bet we could get five gold pieces. And maybe this could be a way out of here after all. No, Rose. What is there to lose, little sparrow? Our lives, our dignity. Come on, there must be someone around here who'll pay us gold to do something. Our sanity? I'm telling you, I'm telling you, sister. It's not worth it. We don't want to go in that castle, but she won't listen to me. Belinda. Never ever. Ooh, 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 look at this, it's Monty. Come here a minute. Uh oh, hold on. All right, wait up, Monty. The guard over here wants to talk to us. Hello, Derek. Lose something? Are you going to say anything, Derek? Come on. My arrest warrants blew right out of my hands. Oh, that sucks. They could be in all corners of Bowerstone by now, and I can't leave my post. Hey, why don't you find them for me? You could be like uh, little constables. Sounds fun, right? You better pay me a million How gold coins. How much constables get paid? Paid? Listen, kids. These are the five most wanted criminals in Bowerstone. Yeah? Well, how badly do you want them? Fine. <clears throat> One gold for all five warrants. Oh, that's bullshit. That's a jip, man. I'm telling you. Right now. Deal. Alright. <laughs> you wanna get- alright, cool. The We're good. The blew off in that direction. Through the alley by that bloke with the picture box. Oh, sweet deal. Thanks, Derek. You suck at your job. Did you know that? So, we'll look out for those warrants. But for now, let's find some more money. All right, we'll do. What does this thing shoot? I want to figure it out. Hold on, let me get a good look here. It's a good day when you get strong-armed by two little kids, I'll tell you. Strong-armed? We have to find more ways to make some gold. We have to. Can you believe this guy? God damn. One gold for doing his job. I yeah, okay. more than words can tell. Worms, Monty. <laughs> No words. Oh, Monty. Oh, then, love. Can we help? How do we help? Knock. Knock, knock. Who's there? <sighs> Come on, anybody? Answer the door. Answer the damn door. It's only polite. You should I'll shoot down your door, so damn it. All right, can I talk to this guy? Your mother is an accursed cow. Oh, wow, that is fucking rude. All right, fine. They don't want our help, then screw them. Shut up, Derek. Oh, cool. Held out Barnum by posing for a picture. Don't mind if I do. Let's do it. Now, all you have to do is strike a pose for my little device. You'll be positively betwazzled by the results. Betwazzled? Is that a word? Ah, yes, I've been improving my vocabularium with a wonderful book bought from Mergo the Trader. A thesaurus. Yeah, you might want to get a refund, He's buddy. He's a bit silly, isn't he? But this could be fun. Yeah, very fun. What pose shall I strike? I'm not sure. All right, help Barnum by doing an appealing position, or expression, I should say, or ruin his photo by doing an impolite expression. Yeah, let's do a heroic pose. Fuck yeah. <laughs> And, oh god. Alright, hold on. I got this. Don't even worry about it. Oh, yeah. I'm a champion. Wondrous. This thing's gonna be more popular than that pox. The pox? Is he talking about a, a disease like smallpox? Now, I just have to wait three months for the picture to developify, and I can start showing it around. The hell's he on about? I almost smell the gold. Oh, hey, you're greedy. Shocker. <laughs> Three months, he says. Told you it was a swindle. Hey, don't make me shoot you in the face, guy. You're ugly anyway. All right. Money for us. 
He's a bit scatty. Hope he's all right. Yeah, I'm sure he's good. Um, all right, Rose, I get it. You like to talk. Where, I think there's like a, a page of the whatever laying around here. Can I knock on this door? No? All right. Fine, be that way. You don't want to talk to me, I don't want to talk to you either. Is there anything around here that I'm missing? I feel like there's something I could loot or something around here. I guess not. Well. Good God. <laughs> Still calling his girlfriend's mom a cow. That's, that's really... Not a good way to get into the this good graces of a girl's family. We should take a look. Rick's got a dog. <gasps> a dog is whining. Boy, I got a treat for you. Oh hell no.